Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path God in Centero. This reading is on Bruno Mars and his girlfriend. I've had someone who has been asking me to do the reading on Bruno Mars. I wasn't sure if it was just career or if it was him and his girlfriend, but I'm going to do a reading on him and his girlfriend, see what comes up. I appreciate all of you guys watching my readings, uh, coming into my channel, subscribing, commenting, sharing, liking, I truly appreciate it. For those of you who are new to my channel, a little bit about myself. I'm a clairsentient clairvoyant, which means I can pick up energies as a clairsentient between people. I can pick up people's personalities. Um, so if you want me to do a reading on you and your boyfriend or husband or just any kind of a personal relationship, even career, I can do a reading on career. Are you in the right career? You know, um, do you feel like you're not living in the right area and want to move and you're not sure if that's a good decision or not? I can do a reading on that. If you would like to get to purchase a private reading on yourself or a celebrity, uh, your favorite ce celebrity, please email me. My email will be below. I will go ahead and email you within 24 hours and my turnaround time is less than seven days. Now, I also have teamed up with Hipsy. I will leave their link below and the only reason I'm, I have teamed up with them is because they accept more payment methods than I do. You can, through them, you can use Venmo, you can use Google Pay, um, you can use Visa, MasterCard, and you can e even use PayPal through them. Okay, it's just, a, it's just an alternative of way of purchasing a reading and more options for payment. Okay. All right. So uh, I appreciate all of you. I really do. All right. So this reading on Bruno Mars and his girlfriend, I just looked them up. They've been dating for 10 years. Uh, now, her name is Jessica Caban. They are born, they are both air signs. He is an, uh, a Libra. She is a Gemini. All right. There's a lot of thinking going on between them now and and i think it's very intellectual sort of it's an intellectual sort of relationship she's a model she's beautiful he's a singer they've been together 10 years i think they like the way it is i don't see these two getting married for them it's like if it's not broke let's not fix it okay if it, sorry, if it, if it's, yeah, if it's not broke, we don't need to fix it. I really, I don't know if they're living together or whatever the case is, but it's like these two get along well on every level. There is no demand from her. There's no demand from him. They understand each other, but it's like, like, obviously they've been to together 10 years. Marriage is not something that either of them, like it matters to them. I just feel like they will keep going on the way it is for the rest of their lives. It's kind of like Goldie Hawn and Russell uh, and Kurt Russell, all right? Living happily ever after the way they are, all right? Okay. I don't feel like she's stressed out and waiting for a ring. You know, I don't feel that from her. This is a nice relationship. All right, what are the energies between them? What are the energies between Bruno and Jessica? Bruno and, and Jessica. They emotionally fulfill each other. Bruno and Jessica. It's like she gives him the freedom to do what he needs to do. And he gives her that freedom as well. I think that's why, I feel like that's why it, it, it works well between them. Okay. The way I do my card readings is I shuffle till one card falls out. Those are clarity cards and jumpers. More than one card falls out, I put it back in the deck. Bruno and Jessica. Bruno and Jessica. Oh, 
Okay. All right, so the first card we have here is the Five of Pentacles, and this speaks about, like, when I look at this card, they are not emotional, highly emotional people, all right? They connect on intellect. So this is, card is usually about being left out in the cold. I don't feel like they leave each other out in the cold, but it's not a highly emotional relationship. They're both air signs. There's a lot of thought and reason in this relationship rather than emotions. See, if they were Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, it'd be more emotional, sensitive. Neither of them are sensitive. They're not hurt easy. So this is more of, uh, there's not a lot of emotions involved in this relationship and it works well for them, okay? All right, Five of Swords. This talks about um, protection, right? You see the Five of Swords, I think he will do anything for her. He will fight for her. He will provide for her. I know she provides probably for herself, but he will, you can see these men walking away and he has, he has gotten their swords. Um, he will do what it takes. He will fight to the end for her. Okay. All right. Now the Eight of Cups speaks about abandonment, withdrawal, it's retreat, it's travel, moving on. I feel that at times the two of them do need to have that rest. That abandonment, withdrawal, it's retreat. It's like they turn their back, they walk away, they're like, I need some space, give me a weekend, I need to go do this, I need to maybe go with the girls, that sort of a thing. So they're, I think they retreat from each other often. They don't need to be together 24-7. And they understand that with each other. See, here we have the hermiting, right? I feel like when they're alone, um, they have more of that clarity it's going within, it's a quest for personal truth. Maybe when they're alone, because the hermit is alone, that is when they understand each other, give each other space, okay? They work well sometimes apart, better apart than together, you know? And then here we have the devil card. And this card speaks about an energy that they, even if they wanted to split up, I don't think they could. There's a lingering, underlying, very good connection here between the two of them. This card can also signify a very um, strong attraction between them. Okay. All right. There you go. That is the reading on Bruno Mars and his girlfriend, Jessica. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope for the person that it kept commenting enjoys this reading. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.